pushing through uh, did not get much at all. Two hundredths of an inch officially at the airport. How about that? Uh, Storm Tracker shows that much of the rain now pushing off to the east of us. Uh, around the Muncie area, a few spotty light showers. Some locations even picking up maybe a little bit of sunshine through some of the clouds right now. Fort Wayne, a few spotty showers. Also around the Muncie area, up across parts of Lafayette, we are seeing a few spotty showers as well. Uh, around Kokomo, maybe a little bit of some light spotty sprinkles up around Marion and Hartford City as well. Officially at the airport, again, two hundredths of an inch. We had officially at the airport for the month of October, seven hundredths of an inch. So now we are up for the month at nine hundredths of an inch here in Indianapolis. And I don't think we're going to see the chance for too much rain here during the day today as well. So maybe a few spotty light showers or sprinkles through about the lunch hour. But after that, we'll hang on to a mainly cloudy sky. Could see some holes in the clouds at times. But in general, later this evening, we will see uh, the rain kind of taper off. Dry conditions expected for the evening drive home and also for those Friday night football games. Want to show you here if we don't get any more rain today or for the rest of the month, which is possible, we may squeak out the driest October on record. So, so far for the month of October, 0 0.09 inches of rain and the driest was back in 1963 where we had 0.17 inches of rainfall. Live look in Speedway, some clouds and even some sun splashing the Speedway right now. 53 degrees. You know, yesterday morning we were waking up to temperatures in the 30s. Not the case right now. A pretty mild start to your morning. 54 in Bloomington and 52 degrees. Good morning to you in Lafayette. Today, mainly cloudy skies. Some sunshine peeking out. 63 at lunchtime. And high temperatures today will be climbing to the lower 70s in Indianapolis. 60s farther northward and farther southward. Those temperatures will be into the upper 70s right around that 80 degree mark tonight. Dry conditions for those high school football games. Kickoff temp here coming in at 64 degrees. Cold front is off to the west of us and behind this front, this is where we're going to see those fall like temperatures arrive, not only for Saturday, but for Sunday as well. I do think both weekend days will be dry, maybe a few clouds at times, but temperatures will return back to normal into the low 60s. Of course, we've got lots of sporting events going on this weekend. We'll first start off here in Bloomington. College game day is coming here to Memorial Stadium. Temperatures will start out into the 50s early at 10 o'clock if you're going to be tailgating. Upper 50s around kickoff and we'll look for a mostly sunny sky. So cooler temperatures this weekend, really closer to normal for this time of the year. But those cooler temperatures are not going to last. I think we're going to watch some more warmer temperatures arrive as we go into much of next week. And then a little system heads in here for the end of the week could bring us a chance for some showers as we head into Halloween. But right now, it does look like that we are going to see temperatures above normal into the 70s for those trick or treaters. In your Hensley Legal Group seven day forecast, another big important sporting event here, Pacers at Gamebridge Fieldhouse on Sunday. We'll get up to 62 degrees, but a frosty start, 36 in the morning, 70 on Monday and warm and windy on Tuesday and Wednesday, mid and upper 70s and 74 for Halloween.